Jonathan Lee Riches, a.k.a. JLR, Justice for Summer Wells. Jackie Dobbs has been making numerous community posts on his YouTube channel lately. Seems like it's in response to the video that I've just made of Jackie Dobbs a couple days ago going to the road way in. I think this triggered him a little bit. I've made a prior video of Jackie Dobbs. I actually went to his house in Georgia. Now, for everyone new coming on, Jackie Dobbs, he owns or owned property uh, right by Don and Candace Wells on the 14th of June, a day before Summer Wells went missing in 2021. Dobbs had a property dispute with the family of Jody Sue Brown, the, the Bernards. Uh, cops got called, law enforcement got called, the Hawkins County Sheriff's. Jackie Dobbs left and then went to the Roadway Inn, the Roadway Inn, which is in near Churchill, between Churchill and um, Rogersville, Tennessee, was up there, and then he made his way back to Georgia. A lot of people throw Jackie Dobbs' name out. I've thrown it out. Never said in any of my videos that I believe that Jackie Dobbs did anything with Summer Wells, but he did respond. He's making posts right now on YouTube. Check this out. So this is the YouTube channel of Jackie Dobbs. Jackie Dobbs, who owns a piece of property right by Don and Candace Wells, who was there on the 14th of June, 2021, Ben Hill Road. He claims on the 15th of June, he was at a nearby hotel, the Roadway in which is probably about 20 minutes away from Ben Hill Road. This is his profile. Click on it and you will see anything I say can be twisted against me. I was cleared early on in the case. You can see here that I actually responded to his post. Hi, Jackie. I will give you $200 to talk to me on the record. I know you could use the money. Let's set it up. Email me, johnnyrichesflorida at gmail.com. Also, hi, Jackie Dobbs. I made some videos about you that you commented on. If you are truly cleared like you claim, come talk to me to set the record straight. Please contact me at johnnyrichesflorida at gmail.com. Other people have been responding. Uh, Ziggy, YouTuber by the name of Ziggy, offered Jackie to come onto her show. Someone responded, oh, stop, leave him alone already. Stop harassing this man. I actually responded, she ain't harassing him. She's responding to public post he made. And then that same person looks like responded again. It's harassment, just like on your post with the neighbor. You know damn well that wasn't Andy threatening to hit someone with logs. You were there. It was BK threatening M MGL. Why not correct that guy instead of posting false information? Let law enforcement do their job and stop harassing these people. So this looks like here a defender of the Wells. Sympathizer. Uh, going back to Jackie Dobbs. Posts. Wells, Bernard, Brown, the evil triad. That's what he posted just five hours ago. The evil triad. Again, I responded to him. Hi, Jackie. I'll give you $200. If you speak with me on the record, everyone wants to hear your side of the story. Here's an opportunity to set the record straight. Email me. Other people have responded. And then here's a post he made. JSB and AB, I'm assuming Jody Sue Brown and Annie Bernard were likely counting on me showing up on Ben Hill Road on 6-15-21. That never happened. I was at the roadway in the entire day except to go to the neighborhood marathon station. Yes, there's two within a mile or two from the inn. In the morning, I visited the Easterly Marathon and asked if they had biscuits. No, but the Westerly one does. I go there, get our biscuits, and return to the inn. 
Later that afternoon, around 4 p.m., I go to the Westerly Marathon and pick up a 12-pack of beer. Then I return to the Roadway Inn, where Elvis and I remain until 11 a.m. the 16th. Elvis, I'm assuming, is his dog. Whereupon Elvis departs to Kingsport to meet me with my attorney, while the attorney's office the Amber Alert comes in around 11.30 or noon. Not having a place to stay in Tennessee, we depart to Georgia. I did not know what went on Ben Hill Road till the Amber Alert came in. My story is true. Andy, timeline, solid. I respond again to his post. Mr. Dobbs, I don't believe you have anything to do with summer. I do believe you can provide insight the world whole world needs. Your name gets thrown around a lot. Come talk to me to set the record straight. I'll give you $200 for your time. God bless. And other people have responded to Mr. Dobbs. You know, a lot of people don't think Mr. Dobbs is involved at all. He's just centered around this case. I mean, he had a piece of property. He was there on the 14th. He had a property dispute with Jody Sue Brown's uh, people that live there, the Bernards. This is that Dobbs guy. That's what he goes by on YouTube. This is Jackie Dobbs, that guy, Dobbs guy. He has 802 subscribers. He puts out 48 videos. A lot of videos that he posts, he is playing the guitar or he's with his animals most of the posts, but he did respond basically to the video that I've posted a couple days ago, me visiting the roadway Inn. I think that's what triggered him to make these latest community posts. So Jackie Dobbs today, I am offering you $200, Jackie Dobbs, $200 to speak to me. This is $200, I can send it to you via PayPal, Cash App, however you like it. Send it to you, check, cash, meet you in person. Would like to speak to you. I know that you've been speaking out and sharing your thoughts on that. So it's not like you want to remain private about the situation. You have made posts. You've said that you know the Wells and the Bernards are a triad of evil. So you know instead of... Possibly you going on to another YouTuber stream or whatever for free or or maybe they'll offer you more money But I am offering you two hundred dollars to speak, you know, it's tough economic times I know that you've posted in the past saying that, you know, you have financial issues This can help I'm not going to talk to you about believing that you did something with Summer. That's not what it's about. I just want to get a lot of insight of what transpired on the 14th. Your alibi that you claim where you were at the Roadway Inn on the 15th. You know, a little bit about, you know, the law enforcement coming to you. Just a lot of unanswered questions, but I think you can provide the public with some insight. You know, and it will definitely be an opportunity to clear your name if you feel that you are innocent. I do believe that you are innocent, that you didn't do anything with Summer Wealth Disappearance, but your name is out there. So this is a direct plea to you. Um, you know, if, if another YouTuber gives you the opportunity to go on, you know, don't do it for free. Do not do it for free, Jackie, because, you know, you have an opportunity to make a little money. I'm giving back. I'm not making much money off an interview with you. It'd probably break even, honestly. It'd probably break even. So, you know, Jackie Dobbs, you can reach me. Johnny, J-O-N-N-Y, Riches, R-I-C-H-E-S, Florida, F-L-O-R-I-D-A, at gmail.com. Or come find me on Facebook. I have a profile on Facebook. You will clearly see my face on Facebook. So, Jackie Dobbs. It's here what you have to say. You know, you said a lot about Candace and the Wells and the Bernards as being evil. Why do you feel that way? And I also, you know, I know a little bit about the law, Mr. Dobbs. So if you need some help with your property line dispute issue, I know that you said you were going, you know, posted that you were going through the courts with that to resolve that or deal with that. 
definitely hit me up because I can help you. I can help you and guide you. You know, attorneys are very expensive. You can do this yourself pro se. I can give you legal advice, you know, any knowledge that I know in reference to that, I can, I can assist you and help you and I'm willing to do that. You know, I just want to know a little bit about you being up there on the 14th of June, the day before Summer Wells was reported missing. So Jackie, look forward to hearing from you. Everyone else, if you have any information about the whereabouts of Summer Wells, contact the Tennessee Borough of Investigation at 1-800-TBI-FINE or contact the Hawkins County Sheriff's Office. It's been over a year now since Summer Wells went missing. Summer needs to be found. Money talks. Jody Sue Brown, you're out there too. I'll offer you $200 if you speak to me, Jody Sue Brown. If you want to speak and, 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 and share you know, a little bit more, I do want to pick your brain more. Jody Sue, I don't, also don't think you're involved with Summer's disappearance. I made that a video about that, Jody Sue. You, I'm sure you've seen it. Um, your father is a, a convicted rapist, though, so that is the truth. You know, I'll put that kind of the side because that really has nothing to do with you. But I'm willing to give you $200 for an interview. So let's talk, Jody Sue Brown, if you're out there, too. Let's talk. Let's have a conversation. You know, I do not believe your story on what transpired, what you said transpired on the 15th. I just think you're interjecting yourself into this fray and making things up as you go. I will say that to you if we have a conversation. But if you want to talk $200, I'm not going to say that you did anything with Summer because I don't believe you did. Jackie Dobbs, hopefully I'll hear from you guys soon. So everyone be safe. God bless. Justice for Summer Wells.